Today on Hook the Future, we're wreck fishing with my buddies Haley and Haley out of Jacksonville, Florida. Stay tuned, guys. We got a great show. April in my hometown Jacksonville, Florida. Spring is here and so are the fish. And man, have I got the fever bad. We've got our new mercury powered Salt Life Scout and it's time to get her salty. We needed a couple of versatile anglers who could handle big fish for today's trip. And we found two anglers who are best friends and share the same name, Haley and Haley. They love to fish and they're up for the challenge. As we pull out of my home port at Beach Marine, excitement fills the boat. You can just feel it's going to be a great day. When we started fishing, we threw the pole into the water and we got a bite instantly. And if he starts running, just hang on. If he does that, just keep the line away from the boat. Hang on. Whoa. Are you kidding me? What do you think about this, Ailey? It's a big yes. fish. Oh my gosh. We weren't ready for this. We came out here wreck fishing, you know, you never know what you're going to find when you're wreck fishing. So we came out to go bottom fishing, but we got out here and I was showing the girls, I said, you know, you can take the top of your rod sometimes and just splash across the top and AJ's will pop up if they're here. And so I did it and I didn't see any AJ's and then like a couple minutes later, here comes the whole school. Woo! We weren't even ready. That's how fishing is. Don't let him go that way. Sounds easy, huh? Just keep the line tight, perfect. Pull up and then reel going down, whoa! Man, this thing is not ready. Are you kidding me, Haley? What's the biggest fish you ever caught? Uh, I think a 27 pound red bass. A 27 big old red bass? Yeah. Oh, I love to catch those things. In the river. Whoa, the belt's going everywhere. Just keep your belt centered. There you go. You got it? Mm -hmm. Put your hand up a little higher, maybe, if you need to. Whichever's more comfortable for you. You got it? Mm -hmm. All right. If you've caught big redfish, you know how to fish then. They bite hard. <clears throat> they don't want run quite as hard as these guys, though. They got a lot more power with that broom tail, but not as much speed. When I found out I was going to be on Hook the Future, the first thing that came to my mind was. I was scared and nervous because I've never been on TV before. There you go. Perfect. Perfect. So I had to rethink if I wanted to do it or not, but then I'm glad I did it. I didn't really think much about being nervous. I just was really excited though. Because like the, that day I found out I was doing a photography shoot right after that and then Friday I was going to do the show. Whoa. Belt straight. Keep your line center. Keep, keep your feet wide, just like you're playing defense on basketball. My favorite sport is basketball, and I realize fishing is a sport too because you have to stay in the same position as defensive basketball, and you have to keep your feet apart so that the fish doesn't get away and you don't drop the pole. You want your knees bent and you're facing the action. With your feet wide. Perfect. Perfect. Whoa! Look at him right there. Hold him, don't, don't reel anymore, don't reel anymore. Lift the rod down a little bit, tip the rod down. Perfect. Man, look at that, are you kidding me? Once we got out here, it was a little challenging to get the fish in the boat, but I think I got a hang of it, so it was fun. So is this your first fish offshore? Uh, yeah. You don't know, first one, that's a good one. Check him out, feel how smooth he is. And these things are fast, aren't they? Big old mouth. 
Alien Jig got him right in the corner right here. Man, and you fought that fish perfect. Yeah, we took this rod and we were slashing on the top, threw out the two ounce Alien Jig, bam. I mean, right on the surface, didn't he? Watch how you release these things. You just drop them down like a torpedo. You ready? One, whoa, 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 whoa. He wants to go now. Here we go, two, three, poof. And he is out of there. Looks like Slimey five. Looks like spit on Real the Real slime. Ooh, fish slime. Probably want to rinse that off. Good start. We'll be right back with more reef donkeys off of Jacksonville, Florida when Hook the Future returns. Hook the Future is brought to you by Eagle Claw, where great fishing begins. By Mercury, number one on the water. By CNH Lures, building quality, trusted lures for over 35 years. By Fish Bites, the bait stays on the hook and the fish stay on the bait. By Salt Life Sport Optics, the finest performance lenses in the world. And by Carolina Skiff, anything is possible. Guys, let me show you the rig that we're using to catch these AJs today. We start off with a 30 pound Andy mainline tied to a 60 pound Andy fluorocarbon leader and then the two ounce Alien CNH jig. You gotta have that CNH Alien, man. Puts the AJs in the boat. Catches just about everything. Cobia, Amberjacks, Dolphin, two ounce Alien jig. Putting them in the boat today. We didn't need to use the heavier weight to get down to the bottom because we got the AJs to come to the top to eat. Uh, but they make them all the way up to nine ounces. So uh, that's what we're using to catch the AJs. If you want to catch some AJs, get you an Alien jig. Perfect. Perfect. Just reel when you can. Well, we got the first fish. I figured I'd let her have it because, you know, she's older. But the other Haley, I didn't really know what to expect because the Amberjack are different. I've never had them before. But once I got my first one, I figured the second one would be easier because, you know, I finally got the first one. I'll try to drive the boat and keep you in position here. Hold on to the pole. At the start of the day, I was really, like, kind of nervous. But as we got out here, I got more comfortable because, you know, it was different from my dad's boat because out here, you weren't as wet and it was calmer. And we actually seen a lot more fish than we usually get on my dad's. And my dad's usually, you have to like wait and be patient. But when we were out on the boat today, you would see the fish come up and there would be a lot of them and, you know, they'd be all like in schools. So usually you would only see one, now you see like a bunch. What do you think about that? Yeah. Pulling hard, huh? Yeah, it's different from what I've ever caught. I know you get to fish a lot, right? Yeah, but I've never caught an amberjack. Never caught an amberjack. What's the big? You've caught a bunch of big fish, though. Kingfish, yeah. I know, kingfish, right? Mm -hmm. There you go, real, real, real. Perfect. Let me tighten this belt up for you a little bit. If I had a friend that was going on Hook the Future, I would tell them to be calm and act like there's not camera there and just have fun. I would tell them it's okay because once the fish start biting, you know, there's nothing really to worry about. You just want to focus on getting the fish in the boat. Well, you're doing good. I hear you're doing great in school. That's why you're out here, right? Yeah, next year when I go to junior high, I'll be in all advance. Oh, cool. Have to work hard for that. It's different from this year. I'm yeah. only in here. So you got to tell people, you know, work hard in school and you get to come play hard out on the boat. <laughs> yeah. Man, those AJs pull hard, don't they? Mm -hmm. They have so much, so bursts of speed. I mean, they'll get going and then, you know, like if you think you got them coming up and then mm -mm, another round. They are tough. Their nickname is a reef donkey. Did you know that? Not yeah, I called it Did he? Yeah. yeah. I've caught some with him. He's caught some big ones. I love it. I <laughs> Man, there's a bunch of them following him up. This is crazy. Alien jigs that catch everything. I've caught dolphin, everything. Dolphin, blackfin, look at them following it up. All right, so let me take this e and alien, mm -hmm. throw it out here. Catch another one. All right, so, uh oh, uh oh. You know you want, you know you want. It's right here. Uh oh, whoa, hey, hey, <laughs> hey, see that? So since we were in deep waters, when you seen the fish up kind of close, it's kind of surprised me because you were in like, what, 100 feet deep and you've seen them up close. And then when you were trying to get them to get it, it would get even closer so you could actually kind of see the amberjack closer. So that was cool. Oh, 
look at them all. Man. Yeah, let's get this fish and then we'll get the other one. I can't help it. All right. That's a nice one, Haley. Hold him steady. All right, check it out. Perfect job. Woo! Here, get back here in the corner with me. Man, can't say it enough. Alien jig right there in the corner. Got him perfect, huh? Yeah. See how these things are streamlined? They got this uh, little bar on top right here. Yeah. Pretty cool. So what'd you think about your first amberjack? They're really tough. Really tough? How yeah. about a slimy five, real slime? Yeah, good job. You ready to let him go? Yeah. We're gonna do it on three. I'm gonna head first down. Are we ready? One, two, two and a half. Here we go. Three. And he is gone. That was so awesome, Haley. One more slimy five. Good to see you out on the boat instead of in the driveway. Like, hey, Haley, how you doing? School good? Yep, school's good. Work's good. See you later. It's a lot better out here, huh? Yeah. I like it. Let's do it again. Whew. Hang on. Hook the future will be right back. On this week's Gotta Have It segment, you've got to have the new Mercury engines with the Skyhook technology. Not only do we have a joystick control on this boat, but it also has Skyhook. I love it when I'm bottom fishing offshore. You want to check a spot, not drop your anchor all the way down, just push the button and let the engines do the work. You gotta have it. Skyhook technology by Mercury. Hang on to him, Haley. Just lean back and hang on because this one's gonna go to the bottom. Oh my gosh, he's going to China. Hold the pole up and let me turn the boat, okay? You got him? Yeah. Hang on. Teamwork. It's just um, Captain Don Haley, Haley and the cameraman today, huh? This is a wing it trip. Like, the weather's so pretty, we gotta do something. Got this new Scout, new Mercury. Gotta get it salty. Whew. Are you kidding me? Look at them all still around here. Keep them tight, Haley. I'm gonna see if we can get a double here. Careful what you wish for. This is fun. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think about it? It's pretty hard, huh? How many more of these amberjacks you guys want to catch? Uh, I don't uh, know. <laughs> They're fighting hard, aren't they? Don't let the line touch the boat, Haley. Good job. This is my workout for the year. It is a workout. I'm getting tired watching you guys. <laughs> this pole's bending, man. Woo! The best part of the day is when, when we had when we were pulling the fish in, we had more than one of us going at once. So there was like a lot more excitement than just one person pulling it in. Oh, there's yours right here. Back up for me, Haley. Perfect. Don't reel anymore. Oh, man. Look at that. Haley and Jig right there. Perfect. Perfect. Good job, Haley. Let's see if we can land this other one. This is a good picture, man. I love these Haley and Jigs. Got the double hooks right here. All right, here we go, real, real, real. Don't hook the future. Holding AJ's, catching AJ's. How you doing up there, Haley? I guess we should let this one go, huh? Whoa. <laughs> All right, let's let this one go. Sure you don't want to kiss him? Oh, oh, got the kiss. Oh, turn the hat back. We can't even see that. One more time, good kiss. There we go. Mm. Oh, that's a good one. He's like, I'm a happy guy now. I'm a happy guy. When kissing the fish, it was really slimy, so I try not to get the slime inside my mouth which is kind of disgusting, but I'm used to it because I love fish. I'm more of a tomboy, so I don't care. Here we go, happy AJ going down, whoa. <laughs> really slime. How's that taste? Delicious. Delicious, I like it, let's do it again. The reason I like fishing is because I like, I like 
because we don't really know what's below the ocean. I mean, we know a lot of species, but there's a lot unknown. So I like, you know, getting stuff that we, because we can't all go down there. So it'd be cool to get, like, another part of the, like, world in, like, like to see it. It's different from us, what we usually see. So. Now, I love fishing at my hometown. I guess everybody does, but I'm a little biased. But there is always something to catch in Jacksonville, inshore and offshore. You know, springtime's just wrapping up, fixing to get into the summertime pattern. Everybody's itching for the cobia to come migrating up the beach. It's a um, fun time of year. Keep them coming. I see color. It's a good fish right here. All right, don't reel anymore. Back up for me, Haley. Reel a little bit more. Reel, reel, reel. A little more, a little more, a little more. There he comes. Perfect. Man, he swallowed it. He swallowed it. Perfect. I'm tired just picking them up. You guys rock, man. Who says girls can't fish? Man, two at a time. What do you guys think about that? Hard. Hard. How did, what, and you were in 100 feet of water and we got these fish to hit right up on top. Is that cool or what? Haley, you gotta watch it. She's trying to move in on your fish here. She kissed the last one, you know. She's looking at this one like they're making eyes here. We gotta get this one back in the water. I'll tell you what. All right, good job, girls. You ready, Haley? There he goes. One, two, three. Man. Amberjack fishing off of Jacksonville, Florida. Don't go anywhere. Hope the future will be right back. Hook the Future is brought to you by Andy. The line of champions. By Easy Rider, the most comfortable ride on the water. By Float On, there's only one real float on. By Tsunami Rods, powerful, sensitive, custom rod performance. And by Odyssey, the extreme battery, extreme power, performance, and reliability. but we saw we ended up seeing a few turtles. We'll see how close we can get. But that's what's so cool about being in the ocean is you never know what you're gonna see. You know, that's why I love it so much, especially out here. This time of year, everything migrates through. The most surprising thing about today was probably how fast we got a fish on the pole. Twist it back. Here, get it back on nothing. Right there. Thank you. It's falling off again. It was hard to keep the fish on the pole because my hands got really sweaty and slippery. So I try not to let go of the pole. But once the little fish was on the surface, it got easier to get him in the boat. You're doing perfect. Trying. You're doing great. I mean great. Get them girls, keep them tight. Come. Keep them coming, Haley. That's a big one. Perfect. My back's hurt. <laughs> My thought of the amberjack is that it was a very powerful fish, and the scales are so small that it's really smooth, unlike the other fish I've caught before, where the scales are big and rough. Perfect. Keep working on yours, Haley. Haley, younger Haley, older Haley. Which Haley's Haley? I guess I'm older, she's younger. Oh, is that how I'm supposed to tell? Yeah. Big old mouth with no teeth. Okay. 
All right, you ready? Mm -hmm. So hold him with his tail right here, and then right under his mouth. You got it? Mm -hmm. Scoot over that way just a hair. All right, we're gonna get this one in. Keep him coming, Haley, he's almost here. Perfect. Keep him coming. Here, step up in front of me for me. Good job. Keep him coming, keep him coming. Oh. There we go. Stay centered on him. Perfect. He's coming now, almost here. Keep reeling, Haley. Reel, reel, reel. Stop reeling. Yeah. Did you girls have fun today? Yeah. Take a kid fishing and do your part to hook the future. You'll be glad you did. Oh my gosh. Let's throw these fish back in and head to the house. Head first. Boom. One more. Boom. There you go. Right here. Well, I, I want one now. Here, give it up. Slimy fives everywhere. I like it, man. It's good. It works good for aftershave, too. You guys don't have to worry about that stuff, but it's pretty good. It's not bad. All right, let's rinse our hands off and catch some more. That was fun. Who says girls can't fish? Not me. Haley and Haley can fish my boat anytime. Fish after fish, they put them in the boat. On top of that, I had them pulling double duty shooting our underwater shots with the stick cam. Did you see those shots? What an awesome day. I can't wait to do it again. To find out how you and your family can take the same trip as you've seen on today's show and what's going on behind the scenes, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter or Instagram. If you want us to share your fishing photos, use the hashtag SlimyFive when posting your pictures.